Hello and welcome to Econ 201 Microeconomics. This video will introduce you to what economics is and why it's important. We live in the information age and the amount and access to information is growing. How is information important to economics? Well, let's first discuss what economics is. It is the study of how humans make decisions in the face of scarcity. This may look different depending on who you are. If you are a middle or upper income earning person in the United States, then it may look like this. But if you are a low income person living in poverty, scarcity may look like this. Whatever the case, if you want more, you or someone working for you must work and produce it. We labor to produce things that we want. We also labor to earn money, to buy things that we want. Adam Smith, an economist and philosopher who lived in the 1700s, had an insight and he called it division of labor. Division of labor, labor is when uh, the creating of a product or service is divided into a number of tasks performed by different workers. Modern businesses do this and by so doing create many job classifications. Dividing work in this way provides the opportunity for workers to specialize in certain tasks where they can have an advantage. This advantage leads to more production at higher quality levels and lower costs. The reduction of total average cost through increased production is called economies of scale. Workers who specialize in producing one certain good or service turn to trade to acquire the other goods and services they desire. In the end, this decision on how to obtain our wants and needs with limited resources is the study of economics. What can you gain from studying economics? First of all, you can find new solutions to issues found in life because these problems have an economic dimension. Second, you can become a better citizen through thoughtful study of issues as you vote and perform civic duties. Third, you can become well versed in economics and be a well rounded thinker, which can enrich your life and the life of those with who you interact. 